go all the way back to the first screen. Jesus. The Wait, I can go all the way back to the ruins? Yes, yeah. you can. Jesus. Way, yes, you should. Yes, do it. Good God, I hear us like, oh, I'm at the end. This will be a short stream, but... No. The coffin is empty? You didn't notice before, but there's something like mummy wrappings at the bottom of it. Yikes. What? Did... Did somebody leave toilet paper in there? Why would there be mummy wrappings in it? Well, because... You... I missed, like, all of this part of the stream, but, like, that coffin wasn't actually for you because the name on it isn't your name. It's Suga's, isn't it? Yeah, because that's what it said to when you go and look at it previously. I completely forgot about that. And there's mummy wrappings in it, so that means that Suga's not dead, maybe. Well, uh... I don't know. Like, is that spoilers? I mean... I think the the Suga character, well, they did die because their soul got smashed into Azrael. Yeah. And then they became, you know, the ultimate hyper, the ultimate god of hyper death or whatever his name is. Yeah. The ultimate Deviantardo, see? <laughs> yeah. And then he just kept shooting rainbow bombs at me. I'm so sad that I missed it. I'm so sad. I'm sorry. And I'm so sad that I missed that I I missed the. The Alphys Undyne almost smooching scene. I'm I so bitter. I, am I actually too. had. I am sad. I could have voiced Papyrus for you, like me. I'm sorry. I, like, I even had to stop at that point because I was laughing too hard at their faces when they're getting ready to kiss. And I'm, I'm just, I'm so, I'm so bitter. I had to go visit family tonight. I'm like, damn it, I don't want to be here. I want to be oh. voicing characters. I'm sorry. It was like the worst, the worst time for me to start the stream too. And I started late. I was like, well, everyone seems to be busy right now. Maybe I should wait a little bit. And so I didn't actually start the stream in, until like 10 minutes after eight. And I was like, I don't want to like start super late. Everyone's gonna be like, why aren't you starting? So I just jumped into it. Oh, Gabby. So with Suga and Azriel, um, Suga was a human that had fallen before. And Suga was found by Azriel right after they had fallen. And Toriel and uh, Asgore took took Suga in like a child of theirs, which Azriel is. Azriel's their kid. And they grew up together until eventually Suga died. And Suga had a plan from what I saw in those videos for Azriel to absorb Suga's soul and pass through the barrier. And uh, when the Azrael suga combination left the, the monster world and went to the human world, the humans attacked Azrael and essentially killed him. Like, he got back to the monster world, but Azrael was killed by the humans and made it back to the monster world just to die. I'm going the really long way to get back to everyone, aren't I? Yeah, you could have taken the elevator. Well, this whole time I was like, maybe somebody's going to pop up. I'm going to go back and take the elevator. And if you if you go back all the way to the very very first screen in the game, you get even more exposition backstory. <laughs> really? Yeah. Do it. Do it. I'm gonna do it just cause like I. I'm not gonna lie. I don't want this game to end, but at the same time, I know it should. I don't know. It's it's bittersweet that I'm finally beating it. And now every single character in the game has new dialogue. Sorry, we aren't allowing any more guests at this time. Or ever again. <laughs> oh god, burger pants. What can I do for you, little buddy? Oh god. <laughs> his voice. I'm burger pants. Uh, burger pants is me. So we're free, huh? Mediton, Mediton told us as much. Then he told me, don't think that means you're getting out of work early. Ah, uh, my boss. I love that guy. And by that, I mean I hate him so, so much. Oh, God. Oh, God. I didn't mean to hit it again. Burger Pants, you're freaking me out. Get out of here. Get out of here. What about Braddy and Caddy? Those are girls. The ones that saw my pants fall down. 
Well, we're all gonna be free, so we'll never see them again, at least. <laughs> Freedom! Don't tell anyone this, little buddy. Because they'll make fun of me. But I feel like I played a hand in everyone getting free somehow. Even if it was just working this awful job, I think I did something. I don't know if it's true, but I'll believe it anyway. Burger Pants, you freak me out. Really? Burger Pants. He's my favorite. Little buddy! There's a brand new world out there waiting for us! I'm sure with my qualifications, it won't be long before I'm a famous movie star. Or maybe I'll just end up flipping burgers again. But it's as I say, nowhere to go but up! Literally, in this case. Okay, I'm done talking to Burger Pants. He's freaking me out. Anytime, little buddy. I love you, Burger Pants. Burger Goodbye. Pants is freaking me out. Burger Pants, get away from me. Never touch me. As a slime, I'm overjoyed. Um, are you guys on your way out? Guess I'll catch up with you later. Good news, the elevator started working again. But now it's been so busy, we still haven't gotten the chance to ride it. Can I ride it? Aww. Oh yeah, I feel so stupid because every time I kept seeing stuff about MTT, I kept thinking there's going to be some really big corporate drama going on in this. There's going to be something where it's like, oh my god, there's this corporation that exists in Undertale that's actually a bad guy too. I never realized it's just Metaton. This, like, until last time I played Undertale. I thought the MTT was just a corporation name. And I think it was actually one of your posts, Jeanette, that made me realize that MTT is Metaton. And I felt so dumb. <laughs> 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 Sorry, the resort's shutting down. But I think you'll find it's still great to pass through. Yes, because they just keep blasting water onto the floor. What about Braddy and Caddy? Are they gone? Nope, they have nope. new dialogue too. Hey, check it out! Okay, I guess Tammy's not gonna do caddy. <laughs> Wait, I'm here. Shut the fuck out of here, I'm still here. God damn, like, yeah, check it out. So, we're like, totally free now, huh? Yeah, like, totally free. Like, cool. Yeah, like, cool. Like, millennia being imprisoned finally over? Yeah, that's like, pretty chill, I guess. I am a human. Oh, oops, really? Uh, well, when we said, um, we were hyped for the destruction of humanity, we were just, like, joking, you know? Did we say that? Probably. It's, like, practically our catchphrase. Really? I thought our catchphrase was... b b Braddy's the best, K-K-Caddy's the coolest! Um, no. We've, like, literally never said that. Can it be, though? Can it be? So, like, what's up? Hmm, now that we're gonna be free... O-M-G. We can finally fulfill our dream of having a pet cat! Okay. That's like your dream, Caddy. But Braddy... I don't want to have a dream without you in it! Oh my god! <laughs> Aw, Caddy! And in my dream, you clean up after the cat! Caddy! Do you like cats? Yes, me? Me? Yeah, yeah I, I love, love cats. cats. They're, They're like, like so, so tasty. Freddy, no! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Kind of. Anyway, when was the last time you even saw a cat around here? Oh! Just the other day, there was this cute little white like, cat walking around. It was like so clue 
clueless looking. I pet it for like an hour. You really are catty. <laughs> catty. Yeah, bratty. I think that was like a dog. Dogs are just from cats. <laughs> hey, check it out. Oh wait, wait yeah, that's... check it out. Oh. <laughs> like, see you later. Like later and stuff. I kind of want to like go to the ruins, like go straight to the ruins right now. Do it. And then come back and talk to everybody else. Oh, well, of course I got to talk to the nice cream guy. I'm so excited to sell ice cream on the surface. If all humans are like you, I think it'll be a modest success. Yeah. Undyne told us that the Royal Guard is being disbanded. Like, bummer. Guess we'll have to get used to love and peace. Yeah. He seems happy. <laughs> okay. So, I will say one thing that I just know from doing this very long walk through the game before is if you keep checking your phone and checking uh, Toriel, she will be sending you text messages constantly. Oh my god. Notice you received a text from Toriel. Dear Frisk, Sans and Alphys are teaching me how to text. I'm learning so much. For example, do you know what a smiley is? Please look at this. Oh! <laughs> now turn your head to the left. It is a picture of me smiling at you. Can you see it? <laughs> LOL. That stands for lots of laughter. <laughs> Sincerely, Toriel. She's like, everyone's not racist, Grandma. That's all for now. Maybe in the next stream you will receive another. Hey, hey, did you remember my name? Did you? Yes, yes. it's Flameboy Hotman. But what? You remember? How can I be so easily defeated? Oh, okay. <laughs> Bye, flame boy hot man. Later, nerd. Please select the location. I think that was the closest one to the beginning. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Flame boy hot man for president. <laughs> flame boy 2016. His catchphrase? Just blaze. Okay, 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 okay. I'll be able to have a nice drink on the surface. Okay, I don't know. Was that supposed oh, to be like? Okay, 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 okay. Was that supposed to be like jazzy oyster? I hope so. Welcome to Hotland. I like how Hotland has this giant neon sign. <laughs> In the middle of nowhere too. It's just hanging on a on a wall, just saying "Welcome to Hotland," but there's nothing else in it. Yep. That's about right. Bah! <laughs> okay. Are you a sheep? You again! Bah! I don't care about going free. Do you think humans could appreciate the details of classic puzzles? Yes. Yes. I, I truly believe there's someone out there grumpy enough to, to appreciate them with you. Me. It's me. It is you. It's me. Do, do the... Do the Temmies go to college? Is that what happens now? I think the Temmies only go to college if you pay for them to go to college. Oh no, I have no way to pay for Temmie to go to college. I failed Temmie. Oh crap. This is still a thing. This is still a thing that happens. There we go. Now it's a thing that doesn't happen. Uh, but now it is a thing that's happening again. There we go. Okay. I don't think we're gonna find Aaron Ruby. I think you can find him. Can I? Think I? He's hanging out somewhere. Oh, okay. Most of the enemies are just sort of like hanging around. Just chilling out, Max, and relaxing, all cool, shooting some people at that side of the school. Yep. And a couple of dudes, they were up to no good. Starting Sorry, to make trouble in my neighborhood. I get yeah, one, one little, little fight. fight. My mom, mom got scared, scared and said, You move to the auntie, auntie and uncle in Bel Air. <laughs> Welcome to Tam Village. Whoa, Tim here knew was very good. Whoa, Tim here knew was very good. Yeah, yeah, Tam's going free. 
Can you imagine if you ran into little Tim out just wandering around? A pleasing development. No. <laughs> Everyone's go free. Put down! Tim not leave. Tim watch egg. Tim will be happily family. It's hard boil. Oh, I forgot. That's why it's not. Mushroom dance, mushroom dance, whatever could it mean? What the? It symbolizes my unbridled happiness. The government told me they are willing to transplant me outside. Why didn't you smile at my dance? It almost feels a little rude. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. She's waiting for someone to let her out. Oh, poor Wall Tem. Statue of Tem, very famous, very. If Tims can go on surface, can see. Lana cute human. What about? Boy, welcome to the Tim shop. Boy, I'm Timmy. Okay, I'm she guessing this. Have, yeah, she doesn't seem to have any alternate text. Ah, uh, okay. Boy. Aww, the Timmies are so cute. I wish they would have shown up more. I want like 20 of them. You want all the Thames, I think is what you mean. All the Thames. Tammy with Tammies. Yes, perfect. It's like you were meant to be. It was. Oh, right, I forgot. That's just. No, it's just exhibition stuck to the wall. <laughs> Exhibition or exposition? Exposition! Did I say- God damn it! <laughs> Your scan has put this on top of No! Yes! Is- Is- His is new. Is Asgore a goat? Eh, goat! Actually, that reminds me! Toriel once wore flower-patterned Moo Moo. Folks kept saying nice moo moo to her, but she kept thinking they were calling her a cow. So she never wore it again. What was the question again? Oh, right. Asgore. He's a really interesting type of monster. The strongest type of all. We call them boss monsters. When they have an offspring, the soul power of the parents flows into the child. Causing the child to grow as the parents age But Asgore doesn't have a child, so he's been stuck at the same age and probably will be forever Huh, what if the child is a human? What? Nah, that wouldn't work. So if Asgore is your father, he'll definitely outlive you Oh, okay Do it. <laughs> Nobody remembers good is this something about exhibition? You said exposition instead of exposition? I said... I said it's a bunch of exhibition type... Uh, yes. Stuck to the wall. Oh yeah. So much exposition... Exhibition... On the walls. Uh. Oh yeah! Of course! Toriel was queen and Asgore was the king! It was tragic when she left! Since everyone knew she was really the brains behind the throne. But it was also just a teensy, teensy bit relieving, you know? Those two were really insufferable together, nuzzling noses, being all cute and cuddly in public, embarrassing their children. Aww. They were so sweet it made me sick! Thank God those days are over! I, I don't think anything else is going to be different. Be careful out there, kid! Is this the... Okay, it's the Trollala person. No, go back up. Go back up. Okay, no. okay. No, get away. Get away from me, Grim Reaper, Jesus, cat, dog, boat person. Have to go see Napster Blue. All oh, right. Wait. More importantly. Metaton! Yeah. There you are, Frisk Darling. Face your eyes! Dr. Apis completed my wonderful new body! 
Ooh. And did you hear? The barrier's open. Hi, Ellie. Hey. I can't wait to see the sun. The greatest spotlight of all. Oh my god. <laughs> oh yes. I suppose I should thank you too, darling. Before fighting you, I had forgotten how fun it was to perform with others. So I've been searching for hot talents to fill up my upcoming troop. Flameboy Hotman, he'll be the best one on your cast. Yes. <laughs> so far, Shiren's agreed to be my backup singer. Yay! Yay! And the Napsa Blue here will be my sound mixer! The three of us performing together. It really feels overdue, doesn't it? Oh god, Ashes, why? Hi, Ashes! Thank you for putting that on Tumblr! Ashes, yes, thank you, I love you. Oh, Meditan, I'm a huge fan. Oh, hi. Human, I'll never forget when you cheered me on. When I was pretending to sleep. No one had ever had so much faith in my fake sleep. Same. Uh, also, this is awkward, but what's your name? Everyone seems to know it now except me. Seems like I've been missing out lately. I was just sitting at home listening to tunes. There was a flash of light outside my window. I saw the snails on the farm disappear. Then I heard a knock at the door. The flash of light wanted to come in. I closed the blinds. Now everyone knows your name except for me. Frisk. Okay, I won't forget it. Master Blue is so adorable. Whoop. <gasps> Diaries? Did we go over those? Yeah, we, we read those. Okay. What? I forgot. Yeah, we read those. Using its money, the snail bought a hat. Oh! I, it just looks like antenna. Did the snail disappear from over here? Oh, but I can't race them. No. Nope. I wanted to scream at the snail one more time. They're trapped in the underground forever. Hi, Ashes, if you can hear me now. Some bird. Now you can take now. I, I won't be bitter now. Oh, no, it's fine. What is just the train? to make sure that we talked to Naps to Bluke and Metaton. <laughs> <laughs> So you helped us all free. I guess I really acted like a dummy to you. Yes, literally. And the house is still on fire and crying. Sounds like only fire lives here now. Sounds like the I, hot place to be. That fire has been going for like days at this point. I don't know how, how fast time passes down here, but I think it's I think since things don't age, maybe fire only burns when it wants to. Tra la la, care for a ride? Let's ride the weird floating boat cat dog thing. Dog boat, dog boat, dog Snowed boat. in, then we're off. And away we go. Dog boat. On the boat, on the boat, on the boat. Tra la la, I heard Asgore has a favorite food. Thank you, Riverman. Oh, okay. Is it goat? I bet it's goat. I believe it's asparagus. Uh, Come again me. sometime. Tra la la. But, but, but Asgore doesn't have a spear. He has a trident. I know, it's not supposed to be funny. Oh, but it could have been. That would have been a better joke for what's uh, Undyne's favorite vegetable. Oh, that would have. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, God, you're both terrible. This it never... It never hurts to try, Dent. It always hurts to try. Now we can play monsters and humans with real humans. Hmm. When humans play monsters and humans, do they just call it humans and humans? Seems like this is the beginning of a brand new boundless world. Haha! <laughs> this adventurous spirit! I'm like a kid again! And my children are like double children! 
Ah, oh, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Oh wait, that's the same as last time. Oh, you didn't, you didn't see ice throwing dog. Oh, right. I forgot about him. Because he's not throwing ice anymore. Oh, God. Hello, Barrel Wolf. Ice Wolf no longer has to throw ice. Ice Wolf can take a break to buy some pants now. That's it. <laughs> okay, so there's just a naked wolf standing in front of me. Oh, we're free? Finally! I'll be able to stop smiling. Looks like I don't have to worry about cracking jokes anymore. I was gonna say a joke here, but I really don't have one. Well, I mean, we already know each other, so you don't really need one. But sometimes, you know, they're good icebreakers. Because he lives, because he lives in Snowden Village. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna leave now. Yes. <laughs> I heard Dr. Alphys told the king and queen the awful things she'd done. The king felt so bad that he didn't know, he gave her a big hug. Then the queen fired her. <laughs> now we don't have a royal scientist anymore. That's politics! Yo, what's up? I've been kind of doing some thinking. Maybe Undyne isn't actually as cool as we thought. She's just kind of mean. But yo, I just found out about someone way cooler. Oh my god. Yes! Yes! <laughs> It'll be nice to show humans our presence under the tree tradition. They'll probably be weirded out by it. It still freaks me out this woman is a bunny walking a bunny. That kid over there told me that it's weird that I have a pet bunny. I'm glad it's not just me! First, there'd be nothing weird about it. It's cute. Second, what? It's normal to walk your younger brother on a leash, right? Okay. Uh. Is anyone else weirded out by those giant shambling amalgamates, or what giant shambling amalgamates? Keep going this direction, you will see one of them eventually. Oh, okay. Eventually. Welcome to. Oh, okay. Well, I'll... I'm gonna I go to. Forget exactly where they are. I'm gonna go to Grillby's first. I'm going to Grillby's. Everyone, stop yelling at me! <laughs> Hello, Grillby's. I missed you. Can I have French fries, please? I wonder if the Overworld has hot guys and neat drinks. Ugh, I'm ready. Soon I'll be able to try some human food. And then I guess I'll try a human bathroom too. Hey, people won't have to move in from the city anymore. Seems like we won't have to lose our local culture. Except we're all moving out of here, huh? Oh well, guess it can't be all punk peaches and punk cream. Grillby's still- Oh! Okay! Oh my god! Grillby actually has something to say to me! Good job. Thank you, Grillby! Wow, a brand new world. I might not get to translate for Grillby anymore. Which is fine, since I was actually just making up what he was saying. <laughs> In the end, I never caught any girls on my fishing line. So kid, take it from me. Don't try to catch hot people with a fishing rod. Somewhere you hear a whinny of dismay. What? It finally won a game of poker against itself. Okay. I'm guessing that was supposed to be Aaron? That's a little... I don't know. I actually don't know what that's referencing. That's... I'm just imagining Aaron just, like, completely... Well, I guess Aaron's not a hot girl, though. He could be a hot girl or, if he wants to be. I say, maybe Aaron is a hot girl. I don't know. I ain't judging. Aaron can be whatever Aaron wants to be. I forgot how long it takes to actually trip. What? Yeah, some it, of the enemies are now just hanging out in the overworld. Maybe someone on the surface will pay attention to me. There are so many people. Someone has to, right? Must be bigger on the inside. Tammy, no! Yes! 
Tammy, no! No! Yes! Everyone's leaving, huh? Good riddance. Maybe I'll finally get some peace and quiet. There's nothing in this direction. Oh, it's okay. The it's the dead end door. Oh, right. That door, like, I think you can open it if you, like, dodge all the credits. There yeah. was a fishing rod on the river? I don't know what's in it, though, so... Yeah, I, I know what's in it because I've, I've seen it online. It's j It's just... It's the annoying dog. Like, it's, it's just a goofy dog. thing. We're all free? Best dog, best dog. Okay, okay, I'll stop lounging around. Does that dog know? It probably doesn't, does it? What dog? Where dog? Oh, okay. Ugh, it's this freaky thing. <laughs> I guess we'll have to go to the surface. There are woods there we can live in, right? Well, I, I yes. <laughs> See, everyone, everyone is okay with Tammy saying horrible things. Please be okay with it, because that's all I say. <laughs> horrible, horrible things. You're eventually going to start a YouTube channel, and everyone's going to start posting the horrible things you say. Whine about gaming, son. Oh what? my god. What? Ash has posted the link to the Doctor Who butt plug. Fuck yes. Yes. I Thank really, you. really hope that my mom didn't let my little brother watch the stream. My nine-year-old brother has been asking to watch the stream for months, and I keep telling him no because we keep saying inappropriate stuff. And my mom asked if he could watch today, and I said, don't look at the chat. And I don't know if my mom knows how to not look at the chat. <laughs> I'm sorry, Cody's mom. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. It's mom. okay. I already had to explain to my mom the team dick-eating thing, and that was embarrassing enough. <laughs> Ha! After all this time, you're still thinking about my hat. Please? No, it's it's fine! Like, he's not supposed to be looking at the chat. Like, it's fine, guys, because I doubt he's here. He's supposed to let me know when he got here. Then I was going to tell everybody, stop saying bad things. Oh, it's one of these guys again. I'm worried about getting older. I'll stop being a teen. No, I refuse. I'll just invent new numbers, like 20 teen. Me. <laughs> Actually, oh Ruffles, God. that's that's very close to what I had to tell my mom. I was like, Mom, if you hear anybody say anything about about me and dick eating, it's a joke. Or is it? <laughs> so did you take that piece of me very far away? Where's the piece? Did you eat it? I I ate it. <gasps> no. Cody. I I almost got killed by Undyne. Cody, what the fuck is wrong with you? I'm so disappointed. There's the amalgamate. The doctor. She brought my wife back from the dead. Yeah. My That's son. Good. He seems happy again. A family. It's bigger than ever. Now that my wife is combined with sixteen other people. It's an orgy every time we have sex. God damn it, Cody. <laughs> Everyone else gets to say horrible things. It's my turn. Anyway, I'm like on Tinder, and there's like this dude No, like, no, Shit. no. What? No Tinder. Yes, Tinder. I already got some messages on there. I got no a couple of super likes. And I think I'm, it makes me feel kind of hot. So I'm going to keep doing it. Maybe I'll meet a nice serial killer. Okay! But that amalgamate, that's Snow Cold, who you fought back oh. in Oh! And, yeah. I love Snow Cold. Oh, conveniently shaped oh. lamp! Hello! Just a conveniently shaped lamp. Okay! It just made me happy. <laughs> okay. I honestly, like, I, I didn't recognize. Ash is about to post something else. Oh, no. Yeah, like, you guys don't need to worry, because I, I don't think my little brother is here. He was supposed to let me know in the chat. He was just supposed to say, hi, Cody, guess who this is, or something like that, to let me know he was here. But if he is here, go to bed. It's past your bedtime. Fuck 
bedtime. Fuck the police. Street funding. He's nine bedtime. years old. He still has a bedtime. I am instilling a spirit of rebellion in him. I am not going to be a bad big brother. He's going to bed right now. I'm going to be a terrible influence. Anyway, oh. so like I'm on Tinder, so why do we have these dudes have like nothing in their profile? It gives me like nothing to work with here. Ooh, a mutual friend. Right no! Here. Ashes, I didn't say we! I said yeah. they! No! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh man. Joe, I'm 22. Ooh, I'm 22. I'm, I'm honestly, I'm. I'm like so. I'm with this conversation is is Cody lamenting and Tammy looking at Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> the true Undertale spirit. I'm a young lady looking for love. Well, I mean, Frisk does flirt with everybody. Yeah. So. It's just like in the game. And so, yeah. Frisk does I mean, actually go on a date with everybody. almost everyone. <laughs> So. I mean, the only ones that Frisk doesn't go on a date with are Asan or no, Toriel and Asgore, because you even go on a date with Sans. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Did oh, I God. say we? God damn it, I meant to say they. I am replying that. Ribbit, ribbit, yellow names were nice for a while. Next time, we should try a relaxing shade of green. Ribbit, ribbit, did you ever find this room's fourth frog? Okay, computer, don't Ribbit, set yourself on say, fire here. Now that your journey's over, maybe you'll have time to listen to me. Nah. Most people just press X to skip through my dialogue. That's yeah. right, pressing X. You've really matured, haven't you? I, I guess. I guess I should probably start reblogging these things. Because as much as, like, as much as I, I put my foot in my mouth, I do enjoy seeing them on Tumblr. <laughs> Charles, he is 24. His description is... I swear to God, Tammy! I'm a good guy. Except he kind of do. So, no. Goodbye. <laughs> the juxtaposition of these conversations. <laughs> Just random Tinder. Oh my God, this guy has a... This guy has a puppy in his profile picture. Astronaut at NASA. Yeah, fucking right. Get the fuck out of here. You went to community college. Damn it, Tammy. We're Where not. is the fourth frog? I'm trying to find the fourth frog. I don't think Where there is, is a fourth frog. The fourth frog is the greater whatever. There's an ant-sized frog in a crack in the wall. It waves at you. Oh. Found it! You found it! We were wrong. We were wrong. No, Ruby, wow. Tammy's not getting to, Tammy's not trying to get me dates. Tammy's trying to get herself dates. I don't need I don't need dates. I have autumn. Cody, 25, living in Florida, in New York for a few weeks on vacation, trying to do something fun, like me. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> Looks like cheese has a nipple taken out of it. Yes! The mouse got the cheese! Hi, Miss Lensher! Oh, I forgot. I had to move those onto it. Go. I actually completely forgot that was a puzzle. Ooh, nah. So I've been left. Casey, 25. Like I swear to God, Tammy! <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. There's something very interesting happening right now, and I'm <laughs> I don't know how to feel about it. I don't either. This guy has his tie undone, and ribbit, he's like, ribbit. Excuse me, human. Me. It's great, nah. You seem like you've grown into a thoughtful and conscientious no. person. I'm just gonna talk over you as you're talking about Tinder. Well, <laughs> screw you, I'm hilarious. Whether that was for my advice or not, I'm quite proud. If you like to ribbit. laugh, swipe right. Well, no, I don't if, know. If you're, gonna, if you're gonna talk about Tinder stuff, you have to do it as papyrus. That's the only way it's acceptable. <laughs> okay. Fritzy, 23. Shallow social work, art therapy, pole of fitness, adventures, lover of the little things in life. Hmm. She's meeting all of my standards. Swipe right. 
<laughs> what the hell? <laughs> now you just gotta get the the cool boy shirt and with the basketball shoulders. Cool girl, mighty too. Or you gotta get the the jog boy, the jog boy uh, cut cut off shirt and sweatband. <laughs> when I when I cool skeleton ninety five. When I lose more weight, I'm so gonna get that. Dude, I wore like nothing but crop tops. Yeah, no, but me and Autumn have started going to the gym, and that's actually why we didn't put out a video yesterday, is because I was way too sore to actually do anything. Okay, he doesn't want to talk to me. And so, if I actually get to a, if I get to a low enough weight where I feel comfortable with it, I will get a Jog Boy shirt and start wearing it when I work out. Jog Boy. Papyrus has the best fashion sense in the game. Yes, he does. Yeah. This guy has two bottles of liquor in his hand. I think I'll like him. Oh my Here we go, here we go. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. He's here! You know my Tinder. Don't worry about me. Someone has to take care of these flowers. Keep talking to him. He has a lot of dialogue. Frisk, please leave me alone. I can't come back. I just can't, okay? I don't want to break their hearts all over again. It's better if they never see me. Why are you still here? Are you trying to keep me company? Frisk? Hey, let me ask you a question. Frisk, why did you come here? Everyone knows the legend, right? Travelers who climb Mount Ebba are said to disappear. Frisk? Why would you ever climb a mountain like that? Was it foolishness? Was it fate? Or was it because you... Well, only you know the answer, don't you? I know why Suga climbed the mountain. It wasn't for a very happy reason. Frisk, I'll be honest with you. Suga hated humanity. Why they did... They never talked about it. But they felt very strongly about that. Frisk, you really are different from Suga. In fact, though you have similar uh, fashion choices, I don't know why I ever acted like you were the same person. Maybe the truth is, Suga really wasn't the greatest person. Well, Frisk, you're the type of friend I wish I always had. So maybe I was kind of projecting a little bit. Let's be honest, I did some weird stuff as a flower. There's one last thing I feel like I should tell you. Frisk, when Suka and I combined our souls together, the control over our body was actually split between us. They were the one that picked up their own empty body. And then, when we got to the village, they were the one that wanted to to use our full power. I was the one that resisted. And then, because of me, we... Well, that's why I ended up a flower. Frisk, this whole time, I've blamed myself for that decision. That's why I adopted that horrible view of the world. Kill or be killed. But now, after meeting you, Frisk, I don't regret that decision anymore. I did the right thing. If I killed those humans, we would have had to wage war against all of humanity. And in the end, everyone went free, right? I still feel kind of sad knowing how long it took. So maybe it wasn't a perfect decision. But you can't regret hard choices your whole life, right? Well, not that I have much of a life left. But that's besides the point. What? My baby! What? Asriel, oh, my okay. child. I'm adopting him. Frisk, thank you for listening to me. You should really go be with your friends now, okay? Oh, and please, in the future, if you uh, see me... Don't think of it as me, okay? 
I just want you to remember me like this. Someone that was your friend for a little while. Oh, and Frisk, be careful in the outside world, okay? Despite what everyone thinks, it's not as nice as it is here. There are a lot of flowies out there. Yeah. And not everything can be resolved by just being nice. Frisk, don't kill and don't be killed, alright? That's the best you can strive for. Well, see you. Frisk, don't you have anything better to do? I think that's the end. Yep, yeah, that's it. Yep. Anyway, there's this guy Aww. on Tinder who went to a French pastry <laughs> Chris Danis is mad at Nightbot again. Swipe right. Swipe left. So, like, Aww. now the complete story of what happened with the Suga character is Suga fell into the mountain, Azriel found them, and they were raised by Toriel and Asgore. But but Suga was the true villain. Yeah, Suga was an asswipe, hated humanity, and so had this idea to eat the flowers that were the poisonous flowers on purpose to get sick and die. So Asriel would absorb the soul and they could become a big death monster. Asriel hyper death. Yeah, and so they went out together, well, mostly just Suga taking over, and was ready to wage war, and then Azrael was like, fuck no, we won't go, and turned around and went back. <laughs> and, um, then Azrael died and poofed into dust, and then his dust became the flower that um, Alpha injected with determination and became flowy. And that's what happened. That's the story. I, I, I can't believe that such a crazy story happened in a game with a spaghetti-loving skeleton and a pun-loving skeleton. Ooh, the Z-Killer. I bet he's a nice guy. I swear to God. <laughs> it's like just two completely different conversations. This is honestly, this is every conversation me and Tammy has, if you can believe it. Like, every time me and Tammy talk, it's either us shouting at each other, ah! or it's me saying puns and then her saying god damn it repeatedly, and then trying to find a reaction image. Yes. Or me talking about cute guys and the killer. Or are you sending me horrible, horrible things. So there was this fan fiction I read. No, 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 I still remember, like, one, the one time that you were, like, I found this really weird fan fiction, and then you sent it to me, was a JoJo's Bizarre Adventure one that I'm not even gonna mention. <gasps> The yeah, context the of it. No, and the, like I said, I'm not gonna mention any context of it. I'm not gonna mention it. Fails. Just look up Dio and fails. No! Yes, yeah, do it. The one time, it was the fucking weirdest thing I have ever read. <laughs> oh, wait. Bagels. I'm going the wrong way. Do it for bagels. No one has weird fan fiction. Undertale. Yeah, I I found I, that out from looking up. Oh my up. god! I was Go just... to the Undertale tag on Tumblr. You get so many skeleton, glowing skeleton dicks. It's hilarious. I've I've never seen people so creatively come up with ways for skeletons to bone each other. <laughs> like really, they can just put a bone there and then call it a bone. It's it's just, man, there's a lot of glowing ecto dicks on on the Undertale tag. I don't know how I feel about it. They're literal disco sticks, my friend. So, oh my god. <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of weird shit going on. I can't believe we're having this conversation in my stream. Oh, you know. You know. It's us. I could I could go on the internet right now, find some really juicy uh, Alphys Undying fanfiction and do it in the voices. Do it, do it, do it, do it. No, no, no. Don't listen to Cody. Do I, th I think of anything... If anything, you should make a, an audio post on Tumblr of oh, Undyne God. reading an Undyne oh, Alphys fanfiction. Right or no, I mean, 
Alphys reading an Undyne Alphys fan fiction. You know, I, I could do it. I'm obviously can canonically. I'm into some some fan fiction. I write fan fiction about my 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 old boss and his ex-wife. You know, okay. as one does. I'll fucking handle this. No, I I will I will mute you. Don't mute me. I will I mute you. No, I just want to get to the end of this game. And then Alphys seductively ran her claws down on the bed. Yes. God damn it. I can just make it up. It'll be bad. <laughs> Here we go. My favorite blog on Tumblr. Oh god. Sexual WWE confessions. Uh, where is it? Where the fuck is it? Where the fuck is it? Okay, there we go. What? Now no one can hear you. What? Now no one can hear you but me. Well, fuck you, <laughs> I'm not gonna have weird shit about what people want wrestlers to do to them. <laughs> because I, I know you're gonna start putting the weird shit that you reblog. Of well, like... I don't want to talk anything. The splits and shit. <laughs> I don't even remember what that one was about, oh, but it's something about thing. some dude with the splits. What's happening? I don't like. Cody on... muted me. He's <laughs> repressing my freedom of speech. God over damn here. it! I don't know how to get you. Like they can still hear you. I don't know how to get you to yeah. stop being heard unless I like end the call with you. God no. damn it! <laughs> there really no is no stopping you. Well, okay. So my favorite confession of all time is if every if anyone knows anything about wrestling. Hang on. We're gonna open this up. It's magical. Ah, Favorite. shit. Yes! I keep falling. <laughs> God damn it, I keep falling off the edge because I keep looking at the chat. Alright, so it's... Nice. So you just keep for the Undertaker. Well, you see, they're this nice oh, one God. that I like named Adrian Neville. And he has my favorite confession of all time. Oh, I don't I even know who that Here is. Hmm. Okay, here's some NXT ones. See, like, I get into these daydreams and begin to fantasize. I actually muted the entire audio except for <gasps> my mic. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I I unmuted you again. Okay, good. I can uh, say everybody's favorite uh, dirty Doctor Alphys confessions. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Oh my God. I don't know any off the top of my head. <laughs> Trust me, if you give Tammy five minutes, she'll find them. This is yeah. when, if anyone in the chat wants to hear Doctor Alphys say anything ridiculous, this is when you let me know, and I'll say something ridiculous. Yeah, I mean. I am willing to do it for the fans. Ooh, I got a new message on Tinder. I swear to God. Oh, I, I completely didn't even talk to any of these people. Oh my God, this guy is like, where do you no, work? No, our parents Not are the same thing. entity. Does that mean I'm married to my sister? Wait, we're dogs. That stuff's normal. Oh, okay. Okay again. All of our parents are combined into one horrible being. That's okay though. It's really brought our families together. <laughs> Having an amorphous shambling family member is great. They're always moving, so I can see them 100% of the time. I'm actually kind of bummed that I didn't come up with more voices for people throughout this game. I didn't actually even start doing voices until I started like having you guys do voices as well. <laughs> oh, I should do all this sexual confessions in Papyrus's voice. <laughs> if anything, okay. If anything, if you guys want to read really weird confessions, because I'm imagining it's gonna take me a while to get back to the end. Yeah, it's gonna take you a while. If you guys want to go ahead and read them. In Undertale characters' voices, as long. Oh, 
fuck. I don't even care. Just read them. I don't care. So <laughs> it's it's all in good fun. So who gives a shit? If somebody has if somebody has a problem with it, let us know and then we'll stop. But otherwise, who gives a shit? Have fun. Yeah, this is a non-work safe stream. And I still haven't seen any messages, so I'm assuming he's gone to bed now. So I don't really want children, but something about Roman Reigns makes me want him to push me down. Hold my legs wide apart, fuck me hard, and impregnate me with a seed. Oh my god. <laughs> well, I wasn't expecting that right off the bat. The worst. Now, completely oh. unrelated, you should be checking the Toriel's phone because oh, it's yeah. really good I, text messages. I thought I saw that or I thought of that when I was talking to Azriel. Toriel sent you a message. Dear Frisk. How are you? You've been wandering around for quite some time now. I hope you're not getting into trouble. Only kidding. LOL. Sincerely, Toriel. P.S. Do not get into trouble. I am getting into all sorts of trouble. Toriel does not send any more messages. Okay. It's every every new screen you go on. Toriel sent you a message. Excuse me. I did not mean to write sincerely. I meant to write sincerely. It is difficult to use this with large hands. Perhaps I should ask Sans to just, um, to transcribe it for me. That would actually be really freaking cute. And it is. And it happens. Toriel sent you a message. Sans will be typing from now on. Oh, okay. Ooh, there's a ni nice guy named Carlos. He lives about five miles away from me. He's six feet tall, you guys. Should I swipe right? I don't know what that means. Okay, I'm swiping left. Bye, Carlos. <laughs> I don't know what what that means on Tinder. I've never I've never even seen anything about any of those apps. Is that where the the squart guy comes from? I think that's okay, Cupid, but I don't oh, really okay. do that. So, okay, there's this nice guy named Ryan. He's 22. He lives eight miles away. Ooh, he plays drums and bass. He but does skates. he believe anime is real? He doesn't. And he doesn't drink. So anime? No Did somebody say anime? <laughs> well, he doesn't drink, so no thank you. So I left. I just realized. What? Toby Fox could actually probably get somebody to make a kissy kissy Mew Mew anime now. Oh, it's probably, like, people already doing that shit, dude. As long as it's Kissy Kissy Mew Mew, the original. Not two, it's trash. <laughs> kissy Kissy Mew Mew 2 is the best. 0% Kissy, 0% Cutie. Absolute 100 garbage. 100% but, but how much my Mew? Met, my, my Metacritic rating is a 0 out of 10. Would not watch again. Fucking bullshit right there. <laughs> I, uh, uh, I, uh, I suggest that if you get your hands on on a copy of it, you immediately put it into your uh, your garbage disposal because it is it is trash. It belongs in the dump, like I do, but like even more in the dump. In the dump, dump. In the dump's dump. The garbage is garbage. That is me, you kissy cutie too, everybody. No, that's my home. Uh, when when you actually said put it in the. Uh... Garbage. When you were saying uh for a split second, I was like, is she gonna say put it in your ass? And it's like, I know it's shit, but come on. <laughs> Gotta put it away. Your ass is worth better than you meal kissy cutie too, everybody. <laughs> worth better. Way up your ass. Swipe. Ooh, Santiago's a cutie pie. Oh my god, everyone's going to 